Hey, what's up guys? So have you ever deleted a file and then realized you needed it? You might check the recycle bin, but what if that's also empty? Well, there's a neat solution to this problem. The app is by a company called Wondershare and it's called Recover It. It's free to download and it's available for both Mac and Windows. Opening it up, you get presented with 8 different recovery options. The first is deleted file recovery, which you can use to scan your hard drive and partitions to search for permanently deleted files. Just know that the search time will vary depending on your hard disk size and usage. Next we have recycle bin recovery. This option is to recover files from an emptied recycle bin and you'll have to wait for the scan to finish before you can actually start recovering any file. Moving on we have formatted disk recovery. So you formatted your hard disk without backing up important data. Well you can use this option to recover parts of your data. Not everything can be recovered but you'll get some of it back. Next we have lost partition recovery. It is for recovering files from a partition that is either deleted, hidden, lost or resized. In case you lose your files while making changes to a partition, scan it using this option and maybe you'll get some of your files back. Following that we have external devices recovery. It's for getting back deleted files on flash disks, memory cards, camera, mp3 player and more. Let me show you how it works. So the app will show you the list of devices attached to the PC and select the one you want to recover from and press start. Before that let me show you what's on the flash disk. So you can see I have only one folder on it which it has a movie and there's no other hidden folders. Let's go back to recover it and start the scan. So the reason why this recovery scans actually work is because when you delete any file it's actually not removed from the device. It's a long concept but easy to understand and I'll link a video that explains the whole process. So do check the description below. Now the scan is completed, you can see that there is one folder and three files showed up. Two Rick and Morty episodes and another video file. You can see the size and their last modified date. Double clicking the folder reveals even more images, videos and music. On the left of the tree view, you can filter them by file type. To recover the files, just select it and click on recover. You get to choose where you want to save the recovered files and I'll just put them on the desktop for now. And in a few seconds you have the recovered file in a folder called recover it and you can do as you please with the file. After that we have another option called virus attack recovery. If your PC was affected by viruses and you lost your files, you can use these options to get some of them back. There is also a system crash recovery in case there are some issues caused by missing files or corrupted files. The final option is an all around recovery, so if you are not sure how you lost the files or if you deleted your files uh, are not showing up on the other scans, you can use this option to scan different devices and partitions. It's your best bet at saving deleted files. That's it for this video and see you guys in the next one.